Hey folks, Lord of Flames here, and we, uh, I mean, I welcome you to a gameplay I'm going to play as Siren Head. It's mostly a good PS1 style game, which I really like, because I try, truly want to get used to uh, old stuff back in those old years. Anyways, this creature was made by Trevor Henderson himself, and this game was made by Slimy Spunk Ghost, which is really good to make this type of game. And I think this game was made years ago, like in 2018, which I didn't know that this Siren Head was made in that time. Because if it was, if I already know in that time, I would make a lot of videos about that. But anyways, here we go. Start, and ooh, a small cutscene. Try to introduce us. Okay. So we're mostly playing as a forest ranger who's mostly searching for missing a hiker who didn't come back for quite some time. That's our truck and why is it all rusted or dirty? Man, this forest ranger is not really good at taking care of his own vehicle. And we're at Pine Ridge Hiking Trail and that's where the hiker was been. Who knows how long this person's been missing. No vehicles allowed but I don't know, if I would like to use it to do something to uh, damage Siren Head or something. I don't know. Anyways, it's a very good looking, I would say. Hmm, let's see up. There he, or there it is, the Siren Head. I just saw it. And it stopped. That was a siren sound, but it is in fact siren head. And... Wait, what's going on with the shadow? Is the sun moving? Oh, it is. It... It's going down so quickly, huh? Well, you're a very quick sun. Ours didn't even go so fast that time. Oh boy. I better get myself quick and... Ooh, what's this? A pack pack. Maybe it belongs to a missing hiker, but why leave it behind? I don't know. Well, let's keep looking. I'm not sure why this... How this siren head came out of nowhere. Like, we did saw those type of photos by Trevor Henson about this cave, uh... structure with these type of drawings, or... Whatever you call it, but it shows him that was that he's been here all along. But there's multiple beings of Siren Head, which this Siren Head creature is not alone. Oh, scratch marks. These weren't made by any animal I know of. That's true. If it ain't no bear or anything, then what's this? A scrapless shirt. Looks like there was a struggle. Well, Siren Head. I usually take some people's shirt off. You don't take mine. <laughs> because you don't want to. Oh well. So there was a struggle. Which I have a feeling these blood tracks are still. That this hacker is still alive in that time trying to escape. But he didn't make it in that time. Because who knows how long this person has been gone. Because he's been uh, wounded a, a lot. Like, look at that, these marks. Those are probably the. The claw marks of Siren Head. And there's some bloods of the hiker. So we're going a little bit up. And more blood. The scratch seems to lead up here. Which it is. Are we going to find a missing hiker? If we're going to see this hiker's dead body. If it has to be, um. What's that in the distance? Hey, what's that? What is that? Okay, wait. Okay. This is a small field, and there's no other trails over there. Only our way out. Our only way is that way. Which I have a feeling, because Siren, we saw Siren Heads coming right over there. Far in the distance. Okay, um. That's a very large blood. Okay, um. Could that be? I have to get back truck now. Hey! Hey! Siren Head! 
had to go away. Hey, how's it going, sweetie? I don't know. Wow, you're very tall. I guess you could against the challenge for Slenderman. Okay, gotta run, gotta run. Luckily, this, they have a control ship to run. Because that would be difficult to, uh, to escape. So we gotta get back to the truck right now. So Siren Head makes some noises. By having some audios, that is not uh, it. Oh well, we make it in time. So let's get out of here. Okay. What? Is that the sound of the hiker? That's a scream, but it sounds different, like it's muffled. Oh, okay, we escaped. Okay. Well, that was fine because I thought we were going to lose because it's just still black. Like, did we drive off or what? Because we turn our truck on and we escape. Like, it doesn't make sense. Like, what happens if I didn't make it in time? Because I might die. So let's go back to it. Because. I don't need to cut this part of the video, I could just keep the thing going. Okay. So we're back. So it's mostly a little bit sunset, and there's the sound of Siren Head, and there, yep. There's the Siren Head. Hey! How's it going, sweetie? How's it going? Doing good? You're doing good. And me? Same thing! Okay, but yeah, so this, this high character we're trying to find is mostly dead now, but I sent, sent there was a struggle, so I think so happened after the hiker was going around this area until Sergeant Head just pops out of nowhere around, the, around these trees and then attacks him. Then there was a struggle after the, after the hiker dropped his backpack, it, it could be heavy to run away if I slow him down. I tell there's a struggle when the Siren Head did in fact try to grab the hiker. And it almost and mostly rips the parts of the shirt. And he got a little bit wounded. And then another type of wound is part of it. So Siren Head gets a little bit faster to it, this hiker. Because this hiker is not very fast enough since he got a little bit wounded. Like in the movies or anything else, when the person gets wounded, they feel a little bit slow and, and heavy. So, this person still running, as he could try, if there is most any footprints. Well, oh well. So yeah, this is where the hiker reached his end. That's when the sign head uh, took the hiker right over there and uh, tore him apart. And steals his voice, not sure how that's impossible, like, like, I, I don't know how we get ourselves with our vocals. Like, I learned this from this uh, horror movie, the, the Silent Darkness, or something like that. Silence, Darkness, Sinister Silence, something like that. That this crazy old lady who's been dead for years and now using these dolls and it took so many vocals of ours, our voice, something like that. But yeah, this is where it happens. I had to get back to the truck now, but no. Where's your sound? You alright? Sweetie? Okay. Take me! Let's hug! Take me! And hug! Come on! Give me a big hug! Okay. Not a hug, then. You only took my... You only snapped my neck. Okay. So that was it for the game if you lose. And the other one I did if you win. So it's mostly a short game. Which I always thought it was a demo if there will be more. But I know it's not a demo. If I wish for it to be, if there would be more. But I know that couldn't because 
having these ideas, giving some random campaigns or stories you have to go to. Do something similar like Slender the Arrivals. Like in the Slender the Eight Pages, it's just a very uh, interesting game that you just collect pages and escape or anything like that. But besides Slender the Arrivals, give itself a story and a campaign. And this one is starting to hit similar to that idea a little bit without any stories or campaigns or anything. Just this. Just introducing the characters. Yeah. So yeah, folks. Hope you enjoyed this. And I can't wait if there will be more Siren Head games out there. Because I would like to want to play more. Which I already saw that Jacksepticeye or and even 8-Bit Ryan is playing this uh, Siren Head game. Which is a very interesting one. So I could think about playing that game if it's free. If not, then I don't know. But anyways, Slimer Head is a very interesting creature that we never seen that much. Until it's getting much more popular around, <laughs> which I truly like. And some people always think about saying there will be games or anything else if there will ever be a movie. Well, that would take some other time to wait for the Siren Head movie if it would be confirmed to be announced or anything. Just like Slenderman would get. Because Slenderman was made years ago, like in 2009 or 2010, until a game was made in 2012 and the sequel in 2014. And uh, a found footage movie made like 2015 or 2014. And then we finally get a real Slenderman movie in 2018, so it will take like years go by, and who knows what year we'll, we'll get this Iron Head movie, if there will ever be a Siren Head movie, because I hope it won't be directed by the, direct, the guy who made Slenderman movie, because we need a good director who got better idea to make it similar to those photos that we saw, even that cave structure with these, uh, paintings. Oh well. I'm not sure what it's going to be like if there will be a movie. Uh, okay, what I'm talking about if there will be a movie, but still, this game is amazing. Hope you enjoyed this, folks. This is the Lord of Flames here. I'll see you guys next time. Bye, folks. Have a wonderful day.